Hardleg and his friends, they're gonna play a lot of games. It's Legs Play. And welcome to Legs Play. Hardleg Joe here with a bootleg Drew. Hey, how's it going, people? And, and today we're playing a new game, brand new game. We're playing Fury. Fury! Or Furry. Uh, Fury with an I, because poor literacy is, is cool. cool. Uh, Joe, I hope you put that thing up on the screen, how uh, it was spelled and everything. Yeah, the graphic that's really important to the joke. Exactly. Yeah, and this is, this is an interesting little game. This is also a Patreon request from one skilled summoner. Oh, hey, skilled, what up, my dude? Yep, probably the most skilled summoners of here. He requested us to play this. Not something I would normally play. I, I think I'm on like the third level. But we're gonna start a new game. We're gonna we're gonna go on Fury mode. Let's There's do also it. Promenade mode. No, I'm full of rage. Let's go. Yep. Everyone can enjoy themselves. It's technically easy mode, but they like to be like, it, no, it's not easy. It's a promenade. Oh, it's you just promenade. You, you just enjoy the, the the fun of existing and watching stuff. Oh, that sounds. And dumb. we forgot to look up there. There was a. There was another game called Fury, because we both thought yeah. this was like an 8-bit game. Yeah. Oh yeah, this game is supposed to have awesome music, too. Really? Yeah, it's it's like one of the things it's really well known for. Hmm. I've heard that the boss fights actually go in time with the music, but if it does, I didn't notice. Gotcha. You were a weapon. A oh, my thing's now vibrating. You're now you're nothing. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm not sure if you could hear my, my yeah, controller no, vibrating. Oh, okay. Welcome to hell. All right, all right. <laughs> Whispery man. He said as he left. Yeah. <laughs> Oh hey! Whoa. It's time to go. I thought that was gonna be like teaching you how to like move, but See no, that? you can't actually do that. Very artisticy game. Yeah. Get out of prison. Oh, it's just a nice little talking rabbit head, man. I don't know if he's nice necessarily. No, he's cool. He's got a golf club. No one can be angry with a golf club. Fight. Don't tell me about Bioshock, that I doesn't mean, count. I mean, he's telling me about fighting for my freedom, so I guess I can't be too mad. You gotta fight dun, dun, for, for your right, right dun, to party! This is secretly the Beastie Boys, all three of them. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. I, I feel like I saw a promotion for this game somewhere, somehow. Yeah, probably. It looks real familiar, but I can't place it. Comment in the comments if you've played or seen this game before. I like his hair. Yeah. It's Nito Burrito. I think I watched the Yahtzee review. They're like, this is like white-haired Bob Marley mixed with Vincent. Yeah, also, the so the camera is really weird outside mm. of combat. Oh, no. It's got tank controls. Oh. But you literally don't do anything but walk to the next boss, so they okay. literally put an auto-walk button. Oh, nice. So you just tap A, and it'll just take you there, and they're like, Enjoy the scenery we made! I hope you enjoy all the different artistic angles and everything we put into it. It actually is quite nice. Yeah, it's very nice looking. This game is just a series of boss fights. I'm about it. Alright, I can With nice-looking visuals in between. He's okay. like some sort of ancient Japanese thing, but yeah. I don't know who. There's someone who's got that circle behind you. Uh, Susano. Ah. If I remember Susano. my Japanese correctly. But it's been a while. There's since a lot I... of weird things floating over Earth. Yeah. I swear I'll put you right back in your cell. How I even got out in the first place, I don't know. Oh, I guess the funny guy. Lightning blade. Maybe he let me out just so he could fight me. Yeah, maybe he's bored. Yep. So, you see this and you're like, oh, he's got a gun. Or no, he's got a sword. And like, nope, this is a bullet hell game. Wait, what? <laughs> That's amazing. Yep. At least partially. And I go up there, ha, ha. I said, I beat the first... I beat the first three levels. Right. So I kind of know how to do this guy. Okay. But it's really kind of awkward to try to parry. When you I don't, don't know, you're know. doing pretty good. Yeah, I, these first three guys, I'm going to get pretty well. 
He okay. says as he gets beaten. Well, this guy's also easy because all you have to do is parry his first blow and then you can attack him. Uh, the other guys, you have to parry like three things at once. I gotcha. Yeah. And they're like, you can charge shot. Oh, nice. Oh. Bam! Bam! Getting him! Satisfying. Ow. Don't, don't let him hit you, Joe. Oh, yeah, and charge slash. I haven't found an enemy I can actually use the charge slash against. All of them so far, except for this guy, have been too fast. Too fast but it's, it's good to know I have it, I guess. Yeah, for Tokyo Drifting. Actually, I'm curious, because they haven't taught me this, but you can you can dash. Okay, so you can keep the charge shot when you dash. Huh. Nice. That's neat. Good to know. Maybe I should try that in the future. How many health bars does this guy have? Uh, see that thing in the corner, all yeah. the squares? Each one of those is a health bar. Jeez. Yeah, they've, they've got... I mean, all it is, all it is is boss fights, so they, you know, they've got to, uh, spread it out a little bit. Right. The boss fights have got to be these long, like, you fool, you haven't even reached my final form. Dang. I mean, you got three health bars, too, so you're good. Right, but you've But you've got to still. restart. Yep, and then he's got, like, some Different. moves you can't parry, because they're just going to attack the whole field, and then you right. just got to, like, get out of the way. And then you dodge. Oh, that's, that's actually neat mechanically. This is a really interestingly designed game. Yeah. It's, it's got a lot of things that it does right, and it's got a lot of things... I think I was telling you, I was like, I don't really particularly care much for this right. game. Although, now that I'm, like, showing it off and doing really well at this yeah. boss... It's uh, it, it looks a lot more exciting than it yeah. is. Now the actual fight begins. That was just the tutorial. Oh, good. I was worried that that was too easy. No. So like that stuff, you gotta dodge out of. Yep, and those little green, those are healths. Oh, nice. So you can get health while you're fighting. Yeah, I like bullet health. And then every time you have a. Ow. Every time you beat, like, a different, uh, whatchamacallit? Wave. A wave of him, you'll get all your health back. Oh, nice. And then, like, if you die with one of your bars, you'll mm -hmm. go back to, like, the start of that wave. Huh. But if you lose all three, then you have to do it from the beginning. Interesting. So it's got, like, kind of arcade mechanics, but kind of not. I would, I it would kind of need that for the style of game they're going for. Yeah. And so, then how it works is, like, you've got that moment where you're, like, it's a bullet hell when it's open, and then you've got the up close and fighting where right. you can't leave this ring. And then it's, like, now you've got a parry. You've got... I think when you parry, you gain a little bit of health. I can't really notice. You tell right. me. Yeah, you do. I saw the green. Haha, -ha, you taunted, you fool! <laughs> Have you learned nothing from Shang Tsung? No, he, he, he hasn't. Apparently not. Apparently not. Whoa! Yeah, from this they're like, yeah, you can fight him up close. I don't know why you'd want to. <laughs> that sounds really hard and difficult. That sounds really... I'd just rather just shoot at him from back here. Whoa! Okay, that didn't work out very well. Oh, jeez. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Have you learned nothing from Shang Soon? Oh, okay. There you go. Blocking stuff. Blocking Stop it. At the speed of Stop sound. it. Get away from me. I don't want any. Oh, hey. Oh. Ow. And. Come at me, bro. Yeah, the, the, that's the one thing that you can't really initiate attacks as far as I can tell. You're right. pretty much just like. Waiting. Waiting for him to do stuff, and then either parrying it or dodging out of the way, whichever one is better. That's more samurai e. Yeah. Oh, and if you get it perfectly, then you get a little... Animation. Yeah. You get your charge animation. I rarely do that. Mm. But you can. Ah. Oh, is he, he's getting up for the third time. <laughs> he's get. I'm gonna keep intimidating you, even though I'm clearly losing this bout. Ow, okay. Well, never mind. Now you're clearly not quite as bad. Get away. 
Yep, just, just, just take there it. taking it like a champ. Yep. Ow. The first time I've seen you, I think, you, I think I've seen you gone down to half health. Well, he is the first guy, so... Yeah. He's only the first guy. The first guy is never hard. Yeah, the first guy is never hard, except for the first time I played this when I played it for like an hour and never beat him. Oh, okay. Except for when I played Dark Souls. That guy was pretty tough. Yeah, you feel good when you do. I can't hear the music. Maybe I should turn up the music. Hey, stop that. No turning. It looks, it's visually very yeah. fun. It oh, nice. I imagine it must be... I don't know. I have no idea what it's like to watch it. I've only played it. Right. I tried to shoot a beam. If you try to shoot beams while you're in this mode, it doesn't work. You do some sort of weird stance that I don't know what it... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're gonna get hit. Oh. But instead... Yeah, got it. We did phase. it. Next phase. Nice. Last phase, hopefully. There you Preferably. go. Preferably. Angry Mask Man... Oh yeah, and then the last phase is almost always like, he's just invincible. You've just gotta like, move all the things, teleport through that. It's literally just like dodging until he gets tired, until he tuckers himself <laughs> out. He's just a tired little boy. He's, he's, just, he's, he's just well past guy. his nap time. Yeah, he's, he's just needs a little ice cream. Don't, don't let oh, him get too angry though. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Yeah, and then the red ones you can't fire through, so... Yeah, dodge. Yeah, you yeah. gotta try to. Ah. One interesting thing is you can hold the A button, and the longer you hold it, the farther you'll oh, dash. Oh, neato, so you can kind of gauge your... Yeah. It's not easy to do, but you can do it. Uh, are you, though, bud? Because <laughs> you seem like you're losing this fight. I don't think you're the best at jailing people. Especially when it's a crazy samurai man. I was a weapon. I'm not a weapon anymore. No, you're just clearly using weapons very, very well. Yeah, now when he's orange like that, that basically, like, you can't, you can't injure him when he's orange. Orange is the international sign of just, like, in unstoppable, apparently. Yeah, apparently, but I think you just whooped his ass. Yep. How long is it? 12 minutes for a boss fight without dying? There you go. <laughs> so that should go to show you, like, yeah, the next boss fight's where I'm not going to do so well. Right. <laughs> Might take a little farther. Oh, damn. That was a kick. Yep. Or a punch or whatever you did. I assume. Do the... We didn't get to see it, yeah. but it sounded like a kick. Yeah. Wah. <laughs> ah. I just... <laughs> 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 dun, 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 dun. Great kill, Bill. You will go back to nah, dog. I ain't going out I, see, like See, at that. first I was going to be... <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about that. Excellent. What a thrill. Not your first time, right? Rude. <laughs> Don't assume that about me. We're one step closer to freedom. I'm assuming he's the final boss. I have no idea. He, he's too well animated and cartoonish not to be. I don't know. Maybe, maybe the just like he's the only one who talks. He's got a microphone too. So worth the trouble. You and me. That's very bullet hell appropriate. Yeah. What's waiting at the end? He's like, it's so worth the trouble. It's like, oh, it better be. Yeah. I, I have high expectations now. One second, I'm actually gonna turn up the uh... music. Turn up the music and the Let's voices. Give up. Focus. Give up. No. Focus. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting way to test it. Okay. Way down there lies a free world. Oh. A world of peace and light, where you're free as the wind. I assume so when you and said you it was free. What? We're going to get there. I hope so. Into the mirror we go. I don't know. I don't trust Bunny Man. <laughs> I bunny don't guy. trust an old bunny guy. Yeah. I mean, he did let us out of jail. Yeah. Maybe we're supposed to be in jail. Most people in jail yeah, are there for a reason. reason, right? Like, we probably killed, like, a bunch of these guys. Yep. Oh, hey. It's a giant ball. That is a giant. Oh, he's just I'll floating incorporeally. What yep. What if he's just in our mind? What if he's answers. just an illusion? It's all why are we imagining a bunny? Does. Are we secretly a furry? Yeah. Is that why it's called furry? <laughs> 
This is all just metaphor. It's all just secretly about a man gripping with his attraction to bunnies. bunnies. I mean, hey, man, or sexually identifying as a rabbit. It's just, no, it's, the final boss is just going to be like a monstrous version of Lola Bunny. Oh, we have wow. to confront our own inner nightmares. That, hey, man. my friend, is a prison. A prison within a prison. <laughs> Prisonception. Not that clever. I don't really feel like it's that clever, but... I'm, I'm pretty sure solitary confinement is like a prison within, within a, a prison. prison. Yeah. Also, this is a really complicated prison. I don't think you need that whole huge Jesus ball. And the prisoner have a lot in common. Well, we are both she prisoners. One day, destroyed everything in her wake, and then, bam, she got caged. Oh, well, she couldn't have destroyed... Well, I guess everything in her wake. Yeah. Like, she destroyed everything. I'm like, well, then how is everything still here? <laughs> She can't just destroy everything. That's physically impossible. It's like, oh, it's an interesting character. What's her backstory? Well, she showed up and destroyed a bunch of shit, and then she just got caged. Yeah, okay. Okay. That's, that's the thing, it's like, I, I guess I kind of like... I don't know, I don't know how to feel about all this, like, walking in between stuff. They had to build all these layers so she couldn't get out. I guess it looks kind of neat, but at the same time, it's like, you could have just given me another boss fight. Maybe pacing? Yeah, pacing. They gotta build up the tension. Yeah, and also, like, I guess, again, it would be a much shorter game if you yeah. didn't walk to all the bosses. If you didn't slowly walk to all the yeah. bosses through a long convo. Why is the door all the way over there? Well, whatever. Don't it's be fine. too Don't be too angry there. Don't be too angry. She it's a little indie game. Through those walls so many times. It didn't work, they though. just kept growing back. Insane. Enraged. She hunt anything and rip it to pieces. Even Santa Claus? Even Santa Claus. But he's so nice. He's jolly down, right? But they'll <laughs> hunt her down all the same. That fat man will be a pork dinner for her. Sad state of affairs. Indeed. Locked up, fucks you up inside. Oh, yeah. Oh, NC-17 so Yeah, there you go. I'm curious, what, what, do you, what do you think this, uh, predict what this next foe is going to look like? Do you have any idea? No, uh, fat lady with a shield and a spear. <laughs> okay. That or an angel, I don't know. Comment in the comments, make your predictions now. Given this area, and it's like, oh, she's gonna tear through everything. And, and it, all we know is it's a she. Yeah. At some jailer. Her jailer is a maze that just keeps yeah. growing back. I mean, that's pretty effective. It was effective for the Minotaur. <laughs> the, the maze didn't even grow for him. That was no. just It was just a maze. It shifted, though. Ah, oh, I did not know that. Yeah. Well, in some iterations, it does. Yeah, because otherwise, people are like, you just follow the left and yeah. you always get out eventually. Yep. Yeah. Well, she started going in circles, and then you know to take a right. It's a robot? Uh, kind of. Like, okay, everyone, if you guessed that it was a snake searchlight on a unicycle, you were correct. <laughs> the look you're giving to me. All right. All right. Yeah. All right. I really like the way this is designed. It's really interesting looking. I can't even tell it's, like, supposed to be a woman. It looks like a, like, like a snake. snake on a unicycle. A snake searchlight on a unicycle. Yeah. With a searchlight for a face. Searchlight face. Searchlight head. Yep. I believe there's a Dick Tracy villain that looks like this. Yeah, well, I'm farther away. I'm just gonna go ahead. Whoop. Okay. Keep shooting things. Yeah, this was... I Even when I... The first time I faced this, this took me significantly less time than the Jailer. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Stop that. D Ow! You just did a little bleach moment. Yep. There we go. There's one. I I definitely can't tell it's a she. Yeah, you'll you'll, you'll see as it goes. This isn't even her final form. Gotcha. Yeah, it doesn't I, even oh, look like, like a on person. Stilts. Yeah, I see. Yeah, her now. now you can kind of yeah. see. Yeah. Weird. Oh god. That's kind of cool. And if you bl yeah, I really like the design of this yeah. one. The next one, not so much. It's Neato Burrito. And you fight her in the maze, and she can blow up parts of the maze, but it always gets Green. regenerated, yeah. so... Oh. 
<laughs> nope, I can't get close enough. Ah! Oh, am I hitting? No. No, okay. There we go. She's too skinny, it's hard to hit her. Right. Like, I'll just slash at you a little bit. Just if you could go into that pit, I'd appreciate it. Give it a test tap, see where it's at. There we go. Would you tap that? Yeah, maybe if she left the motorcycle. Yeah. Or the unicycle. I don't trust any girl who knows how to ride a unicycle. That's a cursed skill, as we call it in the D&D world. A cursed skill, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> I'm Interesting, if <laughs> true. <laughs> I'm not sure if that has anything to do with anything, Joe, now yeah. that you mention it. Yeah, but you know, we're gonna figure it out. Yep. Bye, golly. Ow. I wanna play. I know there's layers to each health bar, too. Like, this is very much designed to be an only boss fight. Oh! Okay, yep. that should have ended the boss fight right there, in my opinion, but cool. Yeah, probably. Oh, God. Oh. Yeah, I can't, I can't really, uh... Yeah, predict her movements. It's really hard to, like, get her on the, the whatchamacallit. The, uh... Parry. Oh, there you go. Now her hands are free. Oh, and her, she's got a giant scythe. Now oh, she's cool. a scythe on a unicycle. Oh, that's even more dangerous. I don't trust any of that. <laughs> I'm just curious, like, if you played this on D... Like, I want to play my bard, but my bard is a uh, woman in a mask riding a unicycle who wields a scythe. <laughs> I would be so about that character. Oh, you could fall off. Yeah. I did not know that. I'd let you build that character. <laughs> I'm glad to know. I'll have to remember that if we ever play D&D again. I'm All curious, right. what's the weirdest D&D character you've ever built? Uh, me? Yeah. Um. I know you're not really known for your, like, super experimental D&D characters, but... I, I think you haven't played with D&D with me for a long time, then. No, I haven't. Um, I just remember mostly your, like, comedic ones, like yeah. Dak Janules. Yeah, Dak Janules. Uh, there was, um, a character who was, uh, I called Bomberman, who was seeking, originally just to be an archaeologist who used bombs to, like, blow up things, then he seeks to learn the perfect explosion. And so I, and then I ended up killing the whole party. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, um, but I think the weirdest, like, the most experimental character I ever made was a skeleton bard <laughs> that, uh, used his bones as xylophones. <laughs> of course he did! Yeah, because, you know, it, it had to be comedic in some way. And so, uh, but, like, my perform- but it, his curiosity was that, like, he couldn't go into town or, like, perform in the tavern to get money without, like, wearing a disguise. So he disguised himself as a buxom maiden. <laughs> I guess that makes sense if you wanted to get the best tips. Yeah. Assuming you've got like protection and such. Yeah. But yeah, it was oh. just it was just a weird character that I played pretty well, I think. But like, you know, then again, it like you don't know truly how people think of your uh, character, like your performance and character. Yeah, a lot of people are just so invested in what they're doing. Yeah. Yep, now she's hacking apart her own feet. Yeah, I kept I kept waiting for her uh, mask to come off and right. reveal some sort of spooky face. Right. But it's no. Not... I'm like, oh, well. I guess I'm free to leave then. Yeah, she mean, fucked she, right off, I she guess. She fucked right off. There's no point in this. I'll just get out of here. I'll just go find the doorway. I mean, yeah, you go find nothing the doorway. to do. Um, yeah. There's got to be a ladder around yeah, here there's gotta somewhere. there's got to be something, right? I, I really feel like this is building up to her pouncing on us and I mean, to she kill will us. eventually, but I'm making fun of the fact that, like, it takes forever. It takes for, yeah. Oh, there it is. She takes a while to decide that she wants to come after you. There you go. There Wiggle you go. Wiggle the thumbsticks! Punch and kick. It's all in the mine. You were meant to be a weapon. Well, apparently so was she, and look how that worked She's out. She's much her. more literally a weapon. Yeah. Her face is a weapon. Yeah, it shoots out laser beams. That's cool. They're like, guys, guys, idea. What if we <laughs> took our laser cannon and put it on a lady's face? Like, well, why? Wouldn't she have more accurate if you put it in her hands or something? Or yeah. kept it on, like, a turret? No, no, no. Because no. then everywhere she looks, she can attack. Yeah, then she's a laser face gal. And like, how could she see you? Like, I don't know. You're reading too much into this. <laughs> You're reading You're too much into killer. this. 
And they're like, wouldn't it be better to put her on a ship? It'd be really fast. They're like, no, she'll be really fast too. We'll, we'll give her a unicycle. unicycle. <laughs> and they're like, Jim, I think you need to stop doing drugs before you come to this meeting. Yep. Jim, I have no idea how you became a structural engineer, uh, weapons <laughs> engineer with yeah. an attitude like that. Yeah. Or he became the best engineer with an attitude like that. Oh, that was an odd noise. Yeah, she makes weird beepy noises. She oh, beep ow. She beep boops you right the fuck out. Yep, and then you do that, and it's super slow, and you leave right. yourself very open to attack. Oh, fuck. She's one of the ones that you can't... Oh! <laughs> that was almost really bad for me. Too bad I can't yeah. knock her off. Ah, good oh, thing is that it? Oh, nope. okay, no. Not quite. She's got one more form. I think this is the one where she's just like... What? Wiggling around. Now she's just shooting all the things. She's just like, I'm just gonna be a turret. I'm what Pa always wanted me to be. <laughs> Papa turret. I'm everything I needed to be. It's I really I thought that I would at least die like one health bar on this. Yeah. I'm starting to regret having practiced on it because it's like now this looks like it's a really easy game. game. Yeah, when it's definitely not. When it's like when I get to the third guy who I like barely beat, this is not gonna be as much. Okay, she's invincible. And the power of teleportation. Damn. Is, is it over? Oh, okay. Am I dead yet? No, not quite. Oh. Oh, she's still invisible. Stop blasting at things. You're not gonna hit me that way. I can literally like walk out of the way. Yeah. I just slow. <laughs> Damn. Oh, fuck. That ah, that's what you get. I didn't notice that she stopped glowing. There we go. There oh, we that go. that was no. so easy. We barely even had time to talk about D and D. I know. Good sound design. Yeah. And of course, oh. Son, save me! Got to just off the off the cliff, just like Darth Maul and the Emperor and all the other great villains of history. Well done. Pretty sure Hitler was thrown off a cliff at some point. Out of her misery. <laughs> I want to correct you, but comedically, that's far funnier than what actually happened. I just, Joe, you put her out of her misery. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad. <laughs> yeah. I was feeling bad because we were both prisoners, and I straight up murked her. Yeah, <laughs> you murked her real good. Yep. I guess she was trying to kill me. On the other hand, I did come into her prison unannounced and not say anything. I didn't even bring like a cake or anything. <laughs> didn't even bring tea. I wasn't even like, I've come to save you. Yeah. The next boss fights would have been better if I had been like, hey, so we can both get out of here. You, yeah. me, and the rabbit guy. You, me, and the rabbit guy. Then what rabbit guy? Nani? <laughs> Nani? Way worse. It all went so wrong. I want you to curse again. It sounded cooler when you cursed, <laughs> rabbit boy. Together. 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 You and me, and me and you. No matter how we tossed the dice, it had to be a bunny-headed guy and me, and me and him. So happy, happy together. together. Oh. I can't do, 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 do something my shoes and all my <laughs> life. <laughs> that was terrible. I'm not very good. We've, I've started doing Twitch sings, though. Hopefully yeah. I'm still doing it when, when this comes out. Yeah. If you want to hear me do actual karaoke with the words, and occasionally cluck like a chicken. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Yeah. This is neato. Yeah. Now we're in a windmill floating island land. Oh. Hey. Who built that windmill? What purpose does it serve? We don't know. It's do we have to navigate this treacherous terrain? Nope. Yep. We just have to walk along it. This would be really difficult to control with the angles and everything. Yeah. If I didn't just tap A to go. Can you feel it? It's like a dream. My eighth grade poetry. Like we could take off and leave this place behind us. I really wonder, like, if you were in eighth grade, if you just turned some of this in as but poetry. You know if they would like nothing yeah. like it. Is what it seems. 
We're stuck here. And the real world is somewhere else down there. Like, that could totally be yeah, like, yeah, can yeah, you yeah, feel yeah. it? It's a dream, but you know better. We're stuck here. The real world is somewhere yeah. else down there. Yeah, that would be that would be something cringy that you would write for your 8th grade <laughs> poetry. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I, I try not to be cynical about these things, but this is just like, eh. I don't know. He's walking sideways. That's yeah. pretty cool. How's he doing this that? I mean, how's any of this doing any of this? Right. Why is the prison letting us out? Right. If those things didn't float in the way, we'd be stuck. Right. <laughs> talking with Bunny Man for all eternity on oh. the sideways rocks. Well, thank God it's moving sideways then. I know. Bunny the Man game progresses. Much of a conversation with. Yeah, I guess if it was just a series Yo, of nine rooms and we opened them There's and a boss was in the next room. Yeah. A master of time, so they say. Ah! But if he's such a master, if he saw it all coming, why didn't he do something about it? Why didn't he stop it from happening? Yeah, or Dr. Manhattan. But look where we ended up. I just got this sweet, like, Daft Punk yeah. sound thing. Welcome to my poetry slam. Me and Rabbit Head Man. Getting it down. Walking down the street in a mirror. Got no time to get my fever. Got no time. Mm. <laughs> Got that, no time. That vamp, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's we like, this kind of goes on for a little not. while. Yeah, it does. We are getting out. We're not cool with this. Oh, we're almost to him. We're, oh, oh, God. That's, yeah. Yep, he's in a big blue dome. Right, and we still gotta wait for all those things to align. That's what we call it the time bubble. Yeah. It's okay, it zoomed out quite a bit. Cool. Oh, what's that? Yeah, I might listen to this time song to on. just on its own. Go cross his path, I wonder friend. if I could play this on YouTube Jared or if it'll get copyright claim. No. Nah. We actually did a cover, uh, not a cover, we actually did a recording back in the early days of Legs Play of Hotline Miami. And it got copyright claimed because the music was like licensed songs and stuff. Ah, so like they were they were just techno songs. But they were licensed. Songs. Yeah. So I just thought they were like made for Hotline Miami, but no. Hmm. Huh. You gotta turn the audio off if you want to do Hotline Miami on YouTube. Interesting. I didn't know that back then. Yeah. I think that's there to freeze time, or maybe uh, it's a camera welcome, watching. Stranger. I have been looking forward to oh. this moment. Oh, hey, it's just Aborigine Man with Beats by Dre. <laughs> How do you get those beats? Those are pretty sick beats. I don't know. Time travel? Steve, but not how far you would get it. How convenient. I am glad you made it to me. Time is a picture in motion through eternity. What does that even mean? <laughs> when you appeared, everything got still. You made the picture stop. Oh, well, the pictures thanks. are supposed to stop. You yeah. made a movie? I'm here to make my clocks tick again. Kinky. Rocks. The power of rock! I can't kill you, but I can remove you from my here and now. Isn't that Capture like killing someone? Back. That is killing someone, Joey. <laughs> He's just being fancy about it. It's like saying I'm gonna unalive you. <laughs> It doesn't make sense, but he's gonna do it anyway. Time to unalive. This is pretty funky music. Oh yeah. Ah, it's reflecting back at us. Yep. He's got reflecty tubes, but it's okay because some of them will give me healy bobs. Oh, ah, lava! <laughs> Watch out, the floor is occasionally lava. That's not good. Yep. What I like about this one is it it can be really hard. But since there's no time limit, if you want, you can just kind of wait for everything to stop bouncing, and right. then it's not as hard. Huh. Like, I can just sort of, so how you doing, Drew? Oh, you, you know, a that's nice time. Yeah. Oh, I had to move over because the things are... I thought they stopped eventually. I guess they don't necessarily. They're slowing down. There's definitely less of them. Yeah. There's definitely less of them, and then the yellow ones, if you shoot them... They give you health. Yeah, they'll turn into healths. They're usually in the middle of a bunch of- well, they can't make it easy on you. Oh, damn it. And not all the yellow ones turn into hell. Some of them are like, whatever. Control, the fight. It is 
It is written. Where is it written? Who wrote it? Why? Where's this book? I want a book. I, I want their credit sourcing. <laughs> sources? He's not citing any of his sources? He's not citing. He's not citing. Oh, my eighth grade teacher would hate him. <laughs> and yet, she loves his poetry. Yes. People love stuff about time being an illusion, man. Yeah. I mean, if they're high. Yeah. Dude, what if all the air I mean, in the world turned into wood? wood? Exactly. <laughs> I love that. Just the high looking dog. <laughs> yep, and then the as you go down the, the next layer, they become the yellow beans, which are uh. slightly bigger and take a couple more things to destroy. And then the third layer is the big undestructible, or less destruct, I don't know. Indestructible bean. Undestructible. Undestructible! Uh, now I want to make an orc that thinks he's indestructible, but every time he talks about it, he can't say it. He just says undestructible. <laughs> I am become undestructible! Now I am become life, the yeah. destroyer of life. <laughs> exactly. Like, what? I need more health for the second phase of this. I hope he could I get him to spawn some more some more healthy orbs. Then he's gonna just punch you. This, this sucks. No, it's, it's fine. This is the fun part. The next part is the hard part. Oh. This is the guy I spent like three hours fighting this guy. This is as far as I've got. I've beaten this guy. Oh, really? Once. There we go. I made it through. And he's like, whoop, whoop, whoop. Experience. And of course, like Yoda. I guess not like Yoda, but. Whoop. And I gotta dodge those. Now he's gonna make a big cube. I don't like his big cube. None. It's rude. It's interesting, again, if you shoot it, he'll shoot the lava out. If you don't shoot it, the lava doesn't come out. Huh. Then you just have to dodge this, so you can kind of control the pace of the fight. By, like, teleport through, go here, get the health, zoom out. I didn't do the zoom out part, but I right, could've. Right, but you could've if you uh, were good at this game. Yeah. Shut up, man! You don't know me! You don't know how I eat my breakfast cereal! <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's an actual quote, quote from Will Ferrell, but I saw yeah. it back in the days of YouTube, yeah. and there's just a picture of Will Ferrell next to it. Yeah. So I assumed that it was something to do with him. Yeah, but you know, even if it doesn't, it's a great quote. I'm yeah. Okay, destroy as many of the things as I can. He seems to be trying too hard to sound wise ah. and all-knowing. Stop it. He's like Gandalf. Stop Gandalf it. Really okay. Tried. There you go. And then you've got to... Every second. Oh. Fucking... Okay. Health. Please. Health. Get away from me. I don't want what you're selling. I just want the health around the field. Go away from me! Sir! Sir! Can I speak to your manager? Okay. Don't be a Karen, dude. <laughs> but Karens are going to get us into Area 51. <laughs> don't you know It's the Kyles that will get us into Area 51. <laughs> just, we got to keep them supplied with monster. There we go. Kick the shit out of that old man. You know, out of context, that sounds yeah. really bad. It's okay, he was a time wizard. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh fans would approve. Time wizard's an annoying archetype? No. Time wizard's that, oh, he's the Yugi, the the Joey archetype. Ah, uh, gotcha. I summon the time wizard. Ah, the time wizard yeah, and his time clock. Yep. Yep, I actually, I, this guy's really hard. And then if you lose to him, you gotta start this whole part over again. That's annoying. With the standing on the cube. That sucks. And all that stuff. Yeah, one of my favorite things though, there's a there's an old meme, but it checks out. Alright. Um, ouch. Oh. Maybe you shouldn't Sorry. try to meme and play. I can do both! You I'll tell you can. when I've had enough. Alright. Anyway, you're saying it was, it was on a dueling book, which is that thing you used to play Yu-Gi-Oh, and yeah. you, you've got to like actually talk with your opponent, kind of like if you were playing a, a real card game. Right. You know, not that Yu-Gi-Oh is not a real card game, but you know what I mean. I know what you mean. And there, there's this guy, he's like playing a Time Wizard deck, which Time Wizard exists. It's an old card, but it's literally like garbage. Right. And he, this guy's like playing a meta deck, and he summons Time Wizard, and he's like, I activate the effect. He's like talking like Joey. Right. And he's like, uh, I activate Solemn Strike, I negate. He's like, you can't negate time! <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. God, like your opponent has called the judge. Make every second count. Dude, shut up! You don't know, shut! 
Okay. Just, just cut him, man. I can't just cut him. I've got to... Okay, well, that time I could just cut him, but... you got to, like, counter him, and it's really hard, especially from this, like, far away perspective. I also like to take it. Shut up, man. That's, that's really weird innuendo, old man. Yeah. Okay, I hit him one of those. Yeah. Great. Okay, now he's gonna... And I can't shoot at him because my bullets are frozen in time. That's dumb. That's dumb. You're dumb. So if I try to shoot him... Got him. Oh. Fuck. I'm getting really invested in this boss fight. I know it's supposed to be entertaining. Fuck! Just, damn. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not enough. The problem is these phases are so fucking long. Yeah. Because it's like... Yeah, you get to the part where you have to fight him, and you gotta do it all on the same health bar. This is why I try to get all that health when I'm on the other's theme. Right. Now he makes the cube, and he does the thing. Yep, now I gotta dance for cubes. Dance and then cubes. by the time he's done, you hear him say, Make every second count! Like a million times, and you're like, I'm making every second count, alright? I've counted every fucking second for the last eight minutes! There's 136, alright? Shut up, old man. You don't know what you're talking about. Shut up, old How many times must I teach you this lesson, old man? It's not looking good. Is it, though? It's not looking good. The floor is lava. That's never good. Just ask yeah. mom. Yeah, usually it ends up with a broken couch. <laughs> yeah, maybe if you're poor. I cracked it. Or maybe if you're rich. Yeah. We were poor. We had stone couches. That sound more sturdy. Yeah, they didn't break. That's good, that's good. Yep. Ah! Stop. Stop it. There we go. Make every second count. There we go, okay, I didn't like connect to him for whatever reason. His timing's so hard to get. And it's not enough, you can't just, like, when you parry one, you've got to, like, parry all of them. Otherwise, you oh, don't really what? get a chance to, like, hit him. Oh, weird. But if you can get close to him... Oh. Ah, fuck, I should have gotten more health. Yeah. Okay, come on. There we go. Ah! Eat shit, old man! <laughs> you don't know how I eat my breakfast cereal? He's got that like, he leans back, and then he does it, and then he leans back, and then he does it. Let's go back. Let's not. Oh, I got him. Eat your cereal! <laughs> not so fast. Oh, great. Ah. Fuck, why am I fucking this up? Dude, you're holding it too long. And he gets back on his square, and then... Zappy over there. And, oh, I fucked that up. One second. I need to get some... Impulsive. This is my time. My space, yours. Will fail. Uh, there we go. Ha-ha! <laughs> yeah, and there's another one, like, if you shoot him, then one of those comes out. And then you gotta dodge both. Interesting. So it's neat because you can kind of time it, and then every, I think, fifth one will have two of those helves. So this phase of all the phases is actually, like, the easiest. Huh, because of all the health. Because of all the health, and because you can completely, like, control when you're going to do stuff. Right, the pacing. Because, like, that time I don't even control. have to dodge through it because I can just shoot that one. Interesting. Oh, God. Oh, mm. oh Okay. I was completely prepared to go to the next episode as soon as, like, I died a third right. time, and then I just happened to beat this old man to the oblivion. Right. And now, now we're, like, on the couch garbage. Yeah. If you know what I mean. A little bit, actually. <laughs> it's about how the- it's about the tone you said it. Oh, man. Ah. Oh, well, that's fine. I damage boosted through it. 
Ah, uh, you don't tell me to wait, I tell you to wait. Fuck, now they're all big and orange and there's so many of them! <laughs> and then you're like trying to shoot them, because the more you can destroy, the less will be around with... And then he comes around whacking you with your wax stick. You don't know me! <laughs> I hate that! The comments are gonna be full of people just like, Make every second count! Oh, uh, you're not making every second count, Joey. You're not being the man that <laughs> Mr. Rogers <laughs> thought you could be. Whoa, don't you talk about that. That's some serious <laughs> shit right there. That's like saying Bob Ross didn't believe in you. Oh no. Bob, to meet. Bob Ross believes in everybody. I hope so. Oh, I got him! I got him! Get away from me! I don't want to be- <laughs> I don't want what you're selling! <laughs> that was really lucky where you dodged. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> yeah, and he parries too. Oh, awkward. That's kind of rude. <gasps> got him! Okay. You are not prepared for this fight. Oh, fuck. And he combines the two of them. Oh! I did it! What? I mean, that's still not even like all of his- that's not even like a fourth of his health. Yeah. There you go. Wait, did I get another thing back? No, you died, I dude. I yeah, I thought I only had one left. Oh. Huh. I guess if you get to one without dying, you get another one. I don't know. What's another topic you want to talk about? Two hour long special? Two hour long special. <laughs> We're not even to one hour yet. But oh, jeez. That's as long as we can get. Ah. Shoot I don't want to end first. in the middle of a... Right, fight. Yeah. That's very anticlimactic. Or is it the most climactic? <laughs> is it the most climactic? Should I end it, like, right before I die? And yeah. then just like... Doom, do, 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 Amazing. I don't know. I'm very wiped out. I, yeah, I'm I not know. much for conversation. I'm sorry. It's quite all right. As long as you can react when I finally do defeat him. Yeah. No. I'll be all up in it. Just, just save up all your reaction. I just, I. That was, that was just terrible. Just concentrate on defeating this old man. <laughs> this decrepit, Aborigines old man. This fucking time master yeah, thinks yeah, he yeah. knows me. He <laughs> knows I eat your breakfast cereal. <laughs> Wait. Wait, stop. You're not supposed to do this. I yeah. foresaw the time and yeah. it wasn't with- I foresaw the time bubble. <laughs> Wesley, there's your warp bubble. Yeah. <laughs> Star Trek reference. Ah. There like, you go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Every second. Oh. Yeah, ah. fuck you, old man. There you go. There Bada you bingo. Go. Okay, come on. Come on, bring it. Okay, no one hit anyone there, so I guess that's fine. I'll take that trade. <laughs> I'll definitely take that trade. Hell yeah! Hell yeah, Batman. Ah. You got forgot you forgot to do the swoop. Yeah. There you go. Now you're swooping. Like a master. Like a goddamn mastermind. Like a swoopster. Like a swoopster. What is a swoopster? Don't ask me about it. I don't have the details. What do I say? What do I look like a swoopster? <laughs> yeah, what do I look like some kind of swoopster? Whoa. Yeah. Basically, Yo. it's that in principle, kids. What the what the white-haired gentleman just demonstrated. Not the. Oh, you taunted. One. He's a taunter. Yep. And one of these. And fuck you. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Hell um, yeah, Batman. Hell yeah. Focus. Let's oh, these ones can't be destroyed. Ah, oh, these ones can't be destroyed. Oh. You gotta dodge around Fun Town. Yep, every ball sends with a dodge, at least the two, the three that I've fought so far. Dodge ah. fast, dodge fast. Ah, what is this, an American car manufacturer? <laughs> <laughs> or Toyota? No, Toyota's Japanese, I thought. He's gotta be right about everything. Oh, I can't, okay. <laughs> Experience tranquility. Experience tranquil. Zenyatta, is that you? Zenyatta, we know it's you. Is this Zenyatta before he became a robot? <laughs> That'd be kind of a cool origin story. We <laughs> don't have much lore on Zenyatta. Like, I'm pretty sure he was born a robot. Like, yeah. robots can't be born. Pretty sure robots are made, not yeah. born. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. I'm pretty sure he was always a robot. I'm I pretty was... sure the Omnics would be like, 
be like, hey, what were you before you were an Omnic? And they're like, excuse me, bitch? <laughs> excuse me, bitch? I was programmed to be snarky. Yeah, I was programmed to be snarky. Back when I was made in the slums of Tijuana. <laughs> do do Omnics make their own Omnics? I don't know, but that seems like a much better way to deal with that, by the way. I'm not sure if that's making less or more stuff. It's making less, I think. It's making, like, no stuff. There's still stuff- oh, it's hitting other stuff, though. Yeah. That's because you made so much stuff, Joe. <laughs> I'm trying not to. He keeps making stuff too. It's not just me, all right. <laughs> Sounds like he's you. guilty of making the stuff. <laughs> Rocco. Yeah, Rocco was being. He's like, I can help. I'm like, yeah. no, Rocco, you're not helping. Yeah. You're only distracting me. Now I've got to do this with a kitty cat rubbing against yeah. my leg, yeah. reminding it's like, hey, war is fine and all, and I know you've got to fight for your freedom, but you could pet a kitty cat. You could pet a kitty cat. Yeah. Everyone likes petting a kitty cat. Yep, even Jordan Peterson says you should pet kitty cats. I don't even Political know that joke. <laughs> he's he's a Canadian. Ah, I gotcha. But he's a, not a friendly Canadian. Oh. Or a polite oh. one. Oh. Ah. Is oh. That, is this it? Is it over? Did I kill the old man on my first attempt? Ish. Did you? Hey. We did Look it. Look at that. Oh, you about to jack this old man? He's got so many pink things on the back of him. Well, if, if I had known that, I would have been like, he deserves everything he gets. Yeah. No one with pink things on their back. We don't stand that he's kind of stuff He's wearing like three watches. Here. Well, he's a time man. Yeah, I know, but you don't need that many watches. Oh. Awkward. You know, I gotta give it to him on this, though. Yeah. He just spends the next hour staring at the clouds. He's like, huh? I don't get it! I don't get it. It's like I tricked him. no fate. We build our own destiny. Isn't that nice? I'm out of this fucking yeah. goblin fighting a time oh, man, man and a man. wizard. Rocks, he knew a lot. He even figured out why you were sent to us. I didn't ask for your opinion, Look tricks. Look at the sky, <laughs> he kept saying. The dot on the sun. I don't remember that no part. I guess you said that before we got here. Yeah. But the, the bunny knew it. Yeah. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this first episode. Next time, Uncharted Territory. Hey, we're going to fight new bosses. Yeah, and maybe food review? Ooh. Possibly. Review. Maybe. Depends. Maybe. Comments in the comments, if you comment in the comments. Comments in the comments, if you comment in the comments. If you like these guys.